My name is Brian Jepson. I am an IEP or Indian environmental professional from Brisbane, Queensland, Australia. Of late, I have had a great many clients who are mold affected uh, or have some sort of inflammatory condition exacerbated by mold or the fear of it even. Uh, I have been quite fortunate to offer perspective uh, and also count, not necessarily counter but offer some insight into the building a bit better and what might be causing some of these mold issues inside of their homes or inside of their offices and such places like this uh, from the building science side of things as well as a little bit of the biology from, of, of the mold side or mycology. Uh, these people that I've gone to see are, are actually some great people and as much as they're going through some some pretty decent struggles they are quite gracious and they're quite open and even through the struggle the bitterness uh, is not so much there there is a lot of fear and a lot of anxiety that is involved in this uh, whole process and I understand that but what I don't understand and why I've come to the point of wanting to do this mold illness uh, made simple course uh, the version 2 course uh, which has just been released uh, is because I don't have a medical degree and I want to understand that a bit better that I might also uh, speak the same language encourage people but also uh, to to understand it for myself that I can be most empathetic and understanding of people's situations that I can help them even better without putting on pressure of hey I'm a I'm a scientist guy I just do data your data tells you this no feelings or being quite brash about it and I don't want to be that uh, so I want to do this mold illness made simple course uh, which I just started yesterday. Uh, the starting part was for uh, about the intro introduction of module one is about inflammatory conditions and how um, sepsis, SIPS, and also uh, SIRS, sorry, and SIRS, which is the CIRS side of stuff, has come from and what it means and a bit of background. And, uh, um, I think there's going to be still some reading further for me to do just doing the module unless it breaks it down some more but I look forward to doing the rest of it uh, so that I can get a bit more of a grasp of it uh, in, in the uh, video uh, in the run through of the modules Sandeep does mention that there is a, a practitioner side of stuff and I wonder if I might be able to um, learn something from that in the future but in the short term I think this is a great start for me because I could keep reading about all sorts of things that the internet might feed to me and it may be skewed or incorrect or half-sighted so I, I'm doing mold in this made simple because it's coming from a horse's mouth who's dealing with these people day in and day out um, I fortunately am not a person who uh, is immediately affected although I do have some condition where my heart gets a real big whoop whoop when I get into some pretty hairy situations and that's when I know I definitely need my mask um, but I want to thank uh, Sandeep Gupta and also Caleb Rudd for creating this uh, program uh, if it is something that you've been curious on or want to understand more for yourself or even from the same perspective as I want to uh, I, I highly recommend it uh, the link and everything I'll try and attach down the below in the comments um, yeah I, I recommend it uh, I've already in just the first module got a better understanding of the side of, you, you hear the phrase cytokine storm and I've not really fully understood it I understand that it it creates a bit of chaos inside the body but I've never really understood how uh, this has offered me some sort of insight as to where that comes from so I'm, I'm quite thankful for that and, and I look forward to building upon that that I might take this my understanding a bit further so I encourage you if you're in the same place please do it uh, and I look forward to speaking with many other people but with greater understanding.
and I thank you for welcoming me. Have a good day.